Time for my original triple axle kablooey. There's the triple axle, and now the kablooey! Gee, Mr. Forsythe, I've been standing here since the first grade. All the other kids are exercising their muscles. What am I exercising? Your neck muscles, Timmy. Excellent. Now one more and go off to the showers. There you go. And here comes the pitch. And it's a line drive up the third base line, fielded beautifully by Bowser. Bowser won't give up the ball, so the runner is tagged out by Bowser and the ball. Thank you. I'm not a big basketball fan, but I'll try to explain what's going on here. There's jumping, and jumping, and more jumping, and falling, and door opening, and more falling, and cruel laughter that will disturb that player for the rest of his life. Meanwhile, over at Vero Beach, another run scores for this new and very young post-strike Dodger team. The runner, Pee Wee Pee Wee, sikes out the third baseman, and then not only steals third, he steals home. Looks like another great year for the Dodgers. I'm all psyched up. My mind is ready for this lift. My arms are ready for this lift. My thighs are ready for this lift. My knees. My knees. Oh, my knees. My knees. My knees. They're not ready for this lift. Oh, my knees. Oi, my knees. Oi, my knees. What do you mean I'm afraid of a horse? I ain't afraid of no horse, and I'll show you. Oh! Guys, you won't believe what he did to me. The sheep had been planning it for months. The day they would revolt and take over the farm. First thing they would do was hold the farmer's wife for ransom. Unfortunately, the cows were not consulted and the uprising ended in failure. But all the sheep enjoyed stepping on the farmer's wife. <laughs> This one's got chocolate milk. You're kidding. Let me try. Oh, you're right. I love chocolate milk. That's enough. I discovered it. Let me back in. You've had enough. I want some. I was born first. Get in line. I started the line. Anybody got a cookie? Yeah, this is a great idea. Opening up a tomato juice stand in the middle of a farm. And it's so hot out. I'm so lucky I got no customers. I can drink it all by myself. <laughs> really hits the spot. Nothing like tomato juice on a hot summer's day being drunk by a jackass. <laughs> and they're off. The bunny and goat race. Goat is leading by a length, followed by bunny. Now bunny makes his move, but goat hangs out on the porch. They're on the back stretch, and it's the goat by a hair. Hey, looks like goat is going to retire. <laughs> This video was submitted by high school teacher Bud Pack of Holbrook High School in Holbrook, Arizona. This car was actually built by his students in the Electric Car Club. The driver is 8th grader Janina White. Now, should you be driving a car if you're in the 8th grade? Maybe if you're 20 years old. But Janina's 14, and perhaps she should have waited a couple months before driving such a precious high-speed vehicle. Too bad she ran into the fence built by the seventh grade electric fence club. Look out, guys! Look out, guys! Look at it. Get the fence, Michael! Get the fence! Look out! Look out, man! We're not letting you drive no more. Shut up! Janina White hits the fence in the high school's electric car. <laughs> this is how to toss a salad the right way. It should be done with all the kids tossing it. <laughs> Don't be too quick to judge now. Instead of fabric softener, Angie Legaski uses a tossed salad with the house dressing. Her boyfriend wonders why he always has olive oil stains in his socks, like he doesn't know. All right, here we go. Slam that thing, turn it on. Great. It's still running now, so let's follow this salad making exercise to its final conclusion. Days later. Of course. Finally, the Movement Center School of Dance in Columbus, Ohio, devised special salad tossing bowls that strapped to these hoofers. Well, let's just watch them, shall we? Oh, yeah, 
yeah, this contest is a breeze. All you gotta do is walk like a doggy. I'll tell you my secret. I walk and I think like a doggy. Oh, over there, there's some bushes. <laughs> Show Miss Sarah how you practice. Yeah, I think it was Miss Sarah's comment about her playing that brought this on. Man, I could have slept until noon. That party at preschool yesterday really plowed me. Oh man, the cereal bowl is making far too much noise. Shh, that's better. Oh God! Turn around. If you're gonna have an oil and lube, it's best to stay in your car. Haley. Oh my God, you got Vaseline everywhere. Remember when Dad told you to be quiet back there or he'd stop the car? So quietly you did something you should never do. Place something like a straw in your sleeping sister's mouth. It helped pass the time until you came to the next rest stop. Oh, those were the days. I can help you. I followed down the road and now I'll save you. Hold still, hold still. Let me grab you here. That problem's not back there, Pally. Guy's telling a bull to hold still. Welcome to the earth, buddy. I got it. Any second now. We're going to be friends now, aren't we? Mm -hmm. uh, you got a 10 second head start. This unfortunate family has a water leak coming down from the floor above. However, it could have been worse. Here's the story. This man set the camera up on a tripod to take his picture, but the wind pushed the tripod, and the man is now rushing to retreat. Oh, look at the camera! Honey, get it! Get it! Oh, oh! This is a praying mantis trying to catch the cursor on a computer screen. Could happen. Or am I saying it did happen? As far as we know, this has never been done before. I don't think anybody's ever done this before. Man, he's a good listener. He started out with a hoop and a stick, and when he got the bike, he threw away the stick, but he just couldn't part with that hoop. The radioactive uh, tomato, it's going to be the butt of uh, many jokes, as you can see. Hey, Dad. I think your, your, <laughs> I think your pants uh, need pulled up. Dude, Parasailer, you have been, wait a minute. Parasailer, attention Parasailer, abort your flight. You have a faulty barness, you have a faulty barness. It can't be right, wait a minute. Oh, you have a faulty harness. Poodle, I'm going after something a lot chewier. I smell a cat in there and I'm going after it. You know, I've always wanted to be a vegetarian. I'm out of here. No, I never met a dog I didn't scare. What? 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 Hello? Do you believe she hung up on me? Uh, I see. Well, let's see. Wait a minute. Let's turn the big light off and see if we can see it. 
You put the flashlight in the potty. 